So I put hashtag necessary. Hashtags are basically just, they are, they're, they're tracking devices, really. Henry, it's, it's sort of like, you know, if you put hashtag postalmate, you'll see exactly what people are talking about postalmate in the various networks. If you put the number sign in front of postalmate and you want to see good or bad, what people are talking about it, put that in Google, you just learn hashtag. That's all it is. Track, for, for us as marketers, that's all a hashtag is. Now, in 2016 January, I had just under 1,000 views from Google. People who came in, active people from Google business page. Do you know what you do, you're familiar with? Have you all claimed your listings in Google? Like for example, we are Island Ship Center. If you put an Island Ship Center in Google, the listing on the right, there's a thing that says business page and it says um, my, uh, write a review and all that. That is now called Google My Business. They, they, just, they just changed that this year. So um, if you haven't, th there will there'll be an icon that, come up, that comes up that says claim this business. So make sure you guys get a Gmail account and uh, preferably and claim that business as your business. So make sure at least you, you do that, that's the first step. Second, start building reviews. Uh, I usually use three platforms, Google, Facebook, and Yelp. Would you go back to claim your business? Mm -hmm. um, if you go, okay, what's the, uh, very easy, what's the name of your business? Downtown Emporium. Okay, if you have a phone right now, go to Google, mm -hmm. put in your, your business name, mm -hmm. and see what pulls up. If that little icon pulls up, claim your business, that means you need to claim your business. It means you need to go tell Google that I, your name? Rowena. I, Rowena, own this. It'll ask you a few questions, and then you've claimed it. So that no one can spam you. There are other, you know, people try to do bizarre things online. That's what that, that is. Okay. Okay? Okay. So, and this is all through these textbooks. So we've turned our drop-off customers into review writers. And the younger generation, they're, they're all, wow, man, you made this so easy. I have people who wait, like yesterday we were closed, they will wait to, instead of going to the UPS store, drop off their textbook, they will come to me and, and, and give those textbooks to Teresa tomorrow because we were closed, because we provide a fix. Uh, next slide. Um, okay, we're gonna, just, uh, we're gonna come back to this, go to the next slide. Oh no, we, where's the hashtag one? The one with the hashtag. Okay, keep going. Hashtag out of order. Hashtag, oh, that's okay. It's all good. There was, there was a thing of hashtag, but um, okay. Keep, go, go back to the Facebook one. Okay. Um, I use three hashtags. Uh, my hashtags that I use for my business and my brand, hashtag Fahim Fix. Okay, I provide a fix to my clients. It's almost like an addiction. I call it a legal drug, AKA hashtag Fahim fix. Um, if you put that in Google, you will see what people are talking about me in almost real time. If you put that in Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, I, 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 I'm there. And the kids, they <coughs> identify with it and they, it resonates and then they start talking. And I have teenagers uh, in, in high school and in college, and, 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 and their friends start talking about it. So I'm able to keep track through these hashtags what people are saying. And if that is not positive, then I'm able to respond. And that's very important to respond. A lot of people talk about negative reviews. If you guys are worried about negative reviews, go to hugyourhaters.com, buy the book, you'll thank me later. Hashtag. Go to YouTube, put in what is a hashtag. I would like to learn about hashtags. Any, just that's it. It's basically a tracking device that is, it came out in 2007, started with Twitter. In 2009 it became really, really mainstream on Twitter and thereafter it's now used on Facebook and all different media, Instagram, yes. How would bring up their phones and just go to Google and 